안녕하세요. Hi everyone. Guys, my sticker app order is here. I just got home from work, I showered, and I am now opening this up. It is very late at night, but I am very excited. These are stickers that I had someone design for me for Hoshi's 1010 day, uh, which is October 10th. It's like his honorary birthday because one of his nicknames is 1010. Uh, I made these stickers and they were having this Black Friday sale, so I bought more of them, but I had it slightly modified so that different parts of it were like holographic. So I'm just gonna open it so you guys can see. Um, this is a design based off of his V Live that he did where he was like basically practicing or making a choreo and then um, just like ended up flopping on the ground and it was so cute. Um, oh my god, it's so cute. Wait, how? Oh my god. Oh my god. All right, here is the sticker and I don't know if you can tell, but he is holographic or he's glittery sorry not holographic this is inchworm hoshi that's what i call him because he looks like a little small inchworm on the ground and i had the cheeks done in like a pink glitter and then the ears and tail in this like uh, orange anyways there is hoshi This is my Dawn doll. I've never had a doll that has come with such an elaborate costume, and I wasn't sure if these shoes were actually gonna fit on his feet, but they do. I have to redo the laces though. Um, this is a really terrible job. He is so cute. Oh my God, this is the outfit that he wore for the 17 Japanese um, Winter Cafe. This is from like a year ago now, or maybe almost a year ago. And it came with also this very cute keychain. And this little badge, obviously with him having long hair back from the early days. Um, yeah, this is like a really cute doll. <laughs> I am very pleased by it. I'm just kind of like surprised by how well everything is made. Um, but it like pretty much works a little bit, kind of unsure about this bear and where it's supposed to be placed. But he is so cute. Oh my God, I love it. Uh, you're probably wondering like, why on earth did you get a Dungan doll, Ava? Um, and well, it's because he's super stinking adorable. And I don't know, I wanted it. So yes. There we go. Okay. Very, very cute, Mr. Yoon Jung Han. Ta da! Hello, I have some packages that I'm going to open. I'm very excited. I think most of it is stationary, although there are some photo cards that I purchased. Let's actually do the photo cards first. So I bought these from someone on Instagram. They live overseas in, oh my goodness, it's somewhere in Southeast Asia, I cannot remember, um, but they actually sent it to my Korean address. So it arrived at my Korean address and then I forwarded it. So they are in here, I'm very excited. Oops. Yay, so we have some Carrot Zone photo cards and they were actually selling this as a set. So I purchased Busok Soon, which is Hoshi, Dokyam, and Sungwon. I was actually just looking for dokyams, but um, I figured I can just sell the other ones. Oh my god, so cute! So I already have Hoshi's, so I don't need his, but he is very adorable. We have dokyam! Oh my god, I love this card. And then Boo is so stinking adorable. I love him with blue hair, so yay! And that's what the backs look like. So excited to have this. There's my invoice. And I'm trying to remember. I don't remember.
remember placing this order, but I did purchase from a lot of sticker shops. I don't know. Um, anyways, here are some very cute stickers. We have some stars and like floral designs and then some like galaxy things. And they also included what looks like to be a lot of freebies. So I'm excited to go through these. Oh my God, it's so cute. There's like a little, <laughs> it says I need beer. Oh my gosh. And then some hearts and then more trucks and things like that. This is a shop, Mia shop. Um, so that is cute. This is from a sticker shop that I've been eyeballing for a really long time. I just destroyed that. I'm so sorry. So, oh my god, these are so cute. We have some little cats and bears. And then we have this. Oh my god, it's so cute. This is a photo card holder. And this is like the beaded chain that just goes up here. But we have a sleeping little puppy. It's in a blue plaid. And then I also have one that's in a pink. So, ta-da! Okay, and then we have... Ooh, what's this? Ooh, I remember. So these are little, like, Polaroid frames that you can put in front of a photo card, and it just makes it into, like, an instant frame. So I got a few different designs. We have some animals, a lot of plaid, because I do like plaid. Here are some hearts um, and other various designs, some, like, argyle. Super cute. And then we have some more stickers. Here are some cats. We have some, like, sea-themed items. Here are some bunnies with carrots, some outer space ones, and then some squirrels. Oop, and then we also have some chicks. Really cute. This is from Okiki, which is one of my favorite sticker brands. They make some really cute items. And, oh, yay! I forgot about these. Okay, I also ordered some, like, little keychains to put on the side of my collect books. So here we have a tiger and a cat. And then this is the tiger, and it's wearing a little dinosaur costume. These are so cute. Yay! All right, and then we also have some box items. I'm trying to cover my, like, Korean address. So, oh my god. What is this? Okay, so this is an order that I placed on Luca Lab, and I primarily got it for this binder. It resembles, it resembles a composition book, and it's like an A5 binder. So I got it for that, and I'm not really sure what these are. Maybe they just came as, like, freebies? I didn't buy these, so I don't know why they're here. Anyways... The other thing that was in this package is like a PVC clear cover that you can put over the binder to keep it protected. So now it's like waterproof and a little bit more protected. And you can also stick things on here uh, and keep the binder kind of intact. I'm excited to put some A5 pages in here and to use it. And then last but not least, we have this package from 10 by 10, which is this big like stationery store in Korea that sells items from a lot of different makers. Oh my God, I have so many things. All right. So let's start with the bigger things first. Um, I did buy more binders, so I am currently in the process of revamping my uh, binder collection and the way that I store my non-17 as well as some of my 17 collections. And I bought this, which is an A5 binder. It zips, and I've seen it featured a lot on Korean YouTubers. So I got this one in pink. It unzips like this, and then there's just the binder inside. There is like a little slot here that you can stick a photo card, and then it has like glitter PVC on the front. So that is what this one looks like. Okay, this is similar. Uh, it actually came as like a planner, but I'm not going to be using it as a planner. I just bought it because it came with this like cover that I really wanted. So this is like the planner on the inside. I will be taking all of this out and just using it as like a photo card binder. There are a lot of pages. Um, very cute though. And then it also has a slot here that you can insert like a photo card or Polaroid, anything that's photo card sized. 
And now here we have lots of binder pages. So I have always used Beyond D binder pages for the most part for my A5 binders. I do also use Amifa, which is a Japanese brand. I'm not a huge fan of the Beyond D pages because they're kind of hard to get photo cards in there. If you don't take your photo cards in or out or a lot and you don't mind the fact that it comes with like this little flap on the top, it's totally okay. But I am a fan of the older Beyond D pages, which were just kind of this simple format where you could stick the photo cards on top and um, it was pretty easy to take in and out photo cards. There are other brands of photo card pages for A5 binders that exist in Korea. I think for the most part though, most people tend to go for Beyond D because they're a big brand, they're very accessible, people tend to do a lot of group orders for them. I decided to purchase these pages from Second Mansion, which is a brand that I've seen a lot, and they're the ones that made these um, binders that I just opened. So they resemble the old Beyond D sleeves, and because I was placing this order, I just decided to buy a lot. I figured that if I actually didn't like them, I could just resell or whatever. But I'm looking at them now, and they actually seem very nice. Um, ooh, they come apart pretty easily, and then they have these flaps on top where you can just put the photo cards. So yes, these are actually double-sided, um, but they're not very thick, so I don't really mind it. And then you can just slide whatever photo card you have in here, and it's just like that. So I think I'm going to be using these moving forward. I will, of course, put my photo cards inside and see how I like them before doing anything. But yes, that is why I bought like a million of these. Um, this is, again, the brand, Second Mansion, and they are the six-hole sticker refill photo card pages. They do make other sizes as well, so they have ones that are like two pocket and one pocket. All right, next up we have some A5 uh, pages. I bought this one, it's like a plaid pattern and there's four different designs on here. Uh, this will just go in some of my A5 binders as like cover pages. Okay, on to stickers. Oh my God, I have so many things. Okay, so let me see. I did buy some sticker packs, so I'm trying to remember which ones I purchased. Uh, a thing that a lot of Korean stationery and sticker shops will do is that they'll have these random packs that are $10 and they'll come with random sticker sheets. So they basically kind of customize it and then um, they sell it for a cheaper value at the expense of you not knowing what stickers they are. So this one, I was about to say, I think this one is just like a pack of various stickers. Yeah, so this is from a brand one of this and I purchased these like leaf stickers. So they come in all these colors. I use a lot of like botanical and floral stickers when I design certain um, deco top letters and decorate Polaroids. So this is really pretty and I bought that. I also have some, oh my God, this is so cute. I also have some bunny stickers, very, very cute. Here are some flowers. We have this sticker pack. Ooh, I remember this. This one's kind of unconventional. Um, I bought it because I just thought they were really pretty and I kind of have like a scheme in mind. So these are kind of like muted, abstract, a little bit modern stickers. Obviously, some of them aren't really conducive for like photo cards and things like that, but I have something in mind for some of the smaller ones and um, some thoughts about what I want to make with these. And then here we have some, let's see, we have a bunny with strawberries. We've got some floral designs here. So some like little bell flowers. Here are cats. Here are clouds, and some of them are in the shape of rabbits, which is so cute. We have some more squirrels. It's really funny because I don't particularly love squirrels in real life, but I think that as stickers, they are very cute. Here we have some balloons, and these are in the shape of rabbits. Here are some flowers, more of that balloon design, and then more of the flowers. This is a, another sticker pack. Um, I'm not gonna open it, but here are the designs that are in this one. They're just like various trees um, and like forest stickers. Here we have some clouds and like funky little planets and stars. I bought some bubble designs. So we have yellow, green, blue, and purple. These are sparkly and very pretty. Some yellow flowers. And then this was actually a purchase that I made because one time I purchased stickers from a shop and they included some freebies and they included these like letter stickers from Second Mansion. So that was kind of how I also discovered the brand. You cannot tell, but in these stickers are like letters and they use this print. So there's this like green and purple plaid, there's this purple and yellow plaid, and then pink and yellow. Um, the designs are just letters again, so I plan on using it for like names and other things like that. And then the last thing that will open is this random sticker pack. I believe this is completely random. I don't remember choosing this um, pack of stickers. Sometimes they'll sell stickers in packs where it's like a set of something, but I think this is one of the random ones. Ooh, so fun. Oh my God, this is so cute. Okay, so we have some like little calendar cards. 
really, really cute. Here we have a, oh my God, is that toast? It's like toast with butter in the middle, but it has like a little face. Here we have some really cute hearts, which I can definitely, sorry, my alarm went off. <laughs> um, I have to drop a preference form for photo cards in like eight minutes. So let me wrap this up really quickly. Um, here are some teddy bears and bunny rabbits more of that type of design. We also have some koalas in this one. Oh my God, this is so cute. Look at this little sleeping koala. Bears, we have this like gingerbread house, which is so stinking cute. Oh my God, perfect for the holidays. And then what is this? This is like little characters and four leaf clovers. We have some like pink beverages. <laughs> this is so random. And then, oh my God, another Christmas one. So this is really cute. Oh, there's like a Christmas tree and snowmen and stockings. And then here we have I don't even know what this is. We have like various foods. So we have like pizza, ramen, and they're like eating it, some burgers and things like that. So yes, this is my little um, small Korean package haul. Uh, I did request a Ford several items from Korea for my Korean address, and this is the first one to arrive. So very, very exciting. Happy to have these and to use my stickers. Uh, thanks for watching, and I will see you in my next clip. I ordered from two Korean Twitter accounts and the first one has this Tiger Collect book and it's so cute! Look at it! I also got a few other things. The first is this photo card holder. I feel like I'm never going to actually use this outside because it's white, but it holds photo cards and it's super cute. It's a bunny. 
And then I also ordered some other items from her. Oh my god, they put photos in here. Look, here are some photos from Aino Chikara. Um, I bought a lot of these lucky good luck cards, and what they are are basically little good luck charms that you can basically have in front of you and use to like manifest your bias or whomever you want when you're pulling photo cards from an album. So I bought two packs of all 13 or 17 and then a few other ones. <laughs> They're so cute. Look at Hoshi the tiger. Oh my god, so adorable. So cute. And then I also got these. They are just photo film strips. So I got this one which has some of my favorite pictures of DK and Hoshi. And then this is one that comes with two different ones and we have some photos that Hoshi uploaded onto his Instagram. They're just really pretty, so yay! And then I started opening this because I wasn't sure what it was, um, but it's actually a package that I thought was stuck in Korea because the tracking code hasn't updated. Um, I don't know if they just sent me the wrong tracking code, but it's here. Okay, so these are items from Okiki, which is a pretty popular Korean stationery store. They sell collect books, they sell stickers, they sell keychains, and a lot of other fun, like, stationery items that you can use for, like, photo cards for K-pop. So a lot of people do shop from them. In addition to being on various stores on Naver, they're also available on K-Town For You. They have, like, a little Twitter thing, which is where I ordered mine from because they were running this, like, December shop. So, yes, I bought this collect book. This is for a friend, so I'm just going to set it off to the side. I got this one, which has squirrels on it. And then here is their little card. I also bought these keychains. We've got a tiger and a bunny. We've got lots of tiger stickers. This is a relatively new item and character that they've released. So I don't know that they're available yet on some of the bigger stores, but if you go to their shop or on like the small stores that you can find on Naver, I think they have already put these in stock. So this is Tommy the tiger and I bought lots of the stickers. We have this photo card holder. This is a chick. This is a bunny. This is a tiger. And then I also bought Please don't think I'm crazy. I bought two Tiger Collect books. Yes, they are so cute. Look at them. I really like single page Collect books actually because they're really fun and they're really portable. So yes, we've got this one and that's what it looks like on the inside, pretty standard. I'm very excited to have all these items. I've actually been waiting for these for a really long time. So I'm finally glad I was able to forward them out and have them. Thanks for watching this clip, and I will see you in the next one. Uh, Thank you.